Hi, Lawrence Payne here, Roman Mosaic Workshops, and I'm going to give you a brief rundown of the starting procedure for the shading in on the Roman Mosaic illustration packs here. Now, you'll find that a lot of these are the strand type of mosaics here, and they're, they're about the, the, the easiest ones to start with. So what we've got here is Solomon's Knot with interwoven looped corner square. You can see there is your Solomon's Knot. There is the interwoven square and each of the corners have been looped over. Now, what you need to do is always make sure that you're working in the same way, particularly with these strand mosaics. So what I have done and I am using the practice sheet rather than the, the nice art paper um, just to get started. I've started on that border around there. You can just shade that in whatever you like, but just to give you an idea. And I'm just doing little squiggles on there. And then I need to look for a line that I can be certain of, a black line. You do just all your black lines. It's easy enough to color in later on, but start with all your black lines. So something I can be certain of, that might be the corner, it might be up here. I know that that curve is there. So I will start filling in that line. Now, these are strands. A strand is two lines of black, either side of three lines of color. So what I want to do is once I have one side of the strand, I need to look for the other side of the strand. So you go in one, two, three. I know that that has to be black and you can see that triangle shape there. No, one, two, three, there's the other triangle. And what we're looking for at the top is this. There you can see triangle, triangle as the strand curves around that white one. So when that's colored in, this is what you get. There. So I can be certain of those lines. I know that's coming down here. Now I need to do in individual strands. Don't just start and then carry on lines here. You need to think about this, this hook piece there. You want to try and get as much of that done as you can see, as you can be sure of. So I know by looking at that, that this goes down there. I'm not sure how far there. Now looking at that, I know that there is that one. We've got the triangles on either side. I know that one is a center tesserae. So I know that one's got to be black there. And this line, this is, it's part of this line. So if I come across there, now I can see how far this one goes. And then I'll take this one up there, as long as I can be certain. Now, the, the, the strand isn't going to go up there, so the only other way it can go is here. So one, two, three colors. There's your other black line. Now I know that is going to be along there. And that has to go all the way along there. I know it can stop there because this one is going to be coming down. So you can see how you start to just build it up. And I'm looking at the triangle there. And see the triangle? I come around there. Now here, one, two, three. I know that's gonna be the black. So you see how you're using the same thing, the same principles every time. Practice with it. Print off a few more of these, uh, these, these practice ones. Uh, give that a go before you go onto your art sheet. And remember to keep the same principles the same procedure every time that you work.